What's up fellow Jaywalkers, this is Jay from Jaywalker POV coming to you from behind the camera with a new weekly series called Live From Last Week. A behind the scenes insight of what my daily activities look like every week. So if you're ready to follow me on this adventure, come join me in 3, 2, 1, go. So pretty much the basis of this show is to take you behind the scenes of what goes on in my life, um, especially now that it is uh, close to Christmas and um, Toronto, the place I live, is going into lockdown as of uh, December 26th. And with that is the idea that people are trying to find new ways of trying to figure out what to do or how to keep themselves busy during this uh, interesting pandemic time where we're quarantining ourselves, social distancing, all that kind of stuff. So hopefully this video will help you guys feel inspired to do things that you want to do uh, in the situation that we're in right now. And with it being uh, December 22nd, just want to wish my cousin Warma Eureka Faldas a very happy birthday. She's made a couple of cameos in some of my uh, Jay Walker POV videos, one of them which you could check it out right there. We miss you, we hope that uh, we can hang out soon and uh, keep uh, the positive vibes up. Also wanted to do a quick birthday shout out to one of my beach volleyball friends, Teresa. Happy birthday, Teresa. As a present for her earlier this year, I put together a highlight video, which you can check it out on YouTube, right up there. So support her and check it out. Tonight is opening night, 2020 of the NBA season. We've got the Lakers and the Clippers on in the background. For all you jaywalkers out there, I want you to comment down below who you think is the next NBA champion. December 23rd is a video editing slash video uploading day. This one's my newest jaywalker POV drone video, which you'll see the link up there. We got the Niagara Winter Festival of Lights being uploaded on Insta. We have on the Facebook page of jaywalker POV skiing for the first time as well as other videos that i'm editing which is actually this current video that you're watching so you can tell this is going to be a busy day plus i have work at the hospital later on and i know you're probably thinking this guy's still riding his bike and it's december 23rd well i am and since december 23rd it's been almost two years since i proposed to my now fiance so just wanted to wish her a uh, happy engagement anniversary two years before i go to work today uh, i'm gonna go visit my lola v i wanted to get here before the lockdown started because i don't know if this site will be closed usually every month i come here and i Say hi to her, just to see how she's doing, check out her site. And I also got my Lola V a present here for Christmas. And yeah, Lola V, continue to pray for us, look over us, and we'll see you in the new year. Merry Christmas, Ola. And today is December 24th, Christmas Eve. Just wanted to wish my cousin, Elijah De Los Santos, aka Elrond, happy birthday. Hopefully for Christmas and for your birthday, you get a set of bows and arrows. And in celebration for Christmas, gonna hopefully surprise my colleagues, giving them presents, dressed up in these scrubs. Ho ho ho! Merry Christmas! Woo! Woo! Presents, 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 presents! And as you can see here, I got the gift wrapping paper ready to wrap presents for some of my colleagues tonight. Snip, 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 snip. Hopefully you guys enjoy that little highlight reel of me enjoying Christmas with my coworkers. I want to wish uh, a happy birthday, birthday greetings to baby Jesus. Hopefully you guys have a very merry Christmas. And even though it's Christmas, the hospitals still stay open. Gotta go back to night shift tonight. Happy Boxing Day everyone. <laughs>
Last night at work, I was able to put on my Santa hat and deliver a couple more gifts to some of my other co-workers that were working with me that weren't able to work with me the night before. Ho 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 Mark! Merry Christmas! Merry Christmas! <laughs> there you go! Thanks Jer! Merry Christmas Michelle! Thanks Jerry! <laughs> <laughs> I got off work two hours ago, 7.30, but I got a voucher for 10 bucks to use on the cafeteria that's at work which opens at 8 o'clock in order to use my voucher they said that the kitchen staff would be late so I decided to wait there for a little bit stayed there until 8 30 for them to let me know that the kitchen staff still was gonna be late I wouldn't be able to use my voucher for any hot meals so what I decided to do was to just use my voucher and I got a small refrigerated cold bucket of their soup so hopefully I'm gonna be able to enjoy that later on tonight 10 30 post night shift and I am home finally after walking 15 minutes from the subway station because it's a holiday and the buses run every half an hour so I might as well walk instead of wait for the bus is it bad that it's past 11 o'clock on boxing day after a night shift and instead of sleeping, I'm just watching boxing videos. One more night, that's it. And then I'm off. It's December 27th. I uh, just finished my last of four night shifts. And last night got to run into a couple of uh, co-workers that I haven't seen in a long while. Teresa, Teresa, come! Teresa, come! We're taking a video. <laughs> Happy Boxing Day, everyone. <laughs> Hi! Happy holidays! Happy holidays! Back to work! Back to work. Nurses, don't stay home! <laughs> so, it was good to catch up with them and see their faces for the first time in a long time. Wanted to also send a birthday shout out to Ravi, one of the beach feeball players I've played with in the summer. Uh, happy birthday Ravi! Hope you have a good one. After I wake up from my post night shift nap, I'll be able to open some Christmas presents that I haven't gotten around to yet. So can't wait till I wake up. After a couple of hours sleep, I've decided not to open up my Christmas presents yet. Gonna see if I can wait for the fiance before opening up all the presents. So at least I have somebody to open them up with. So tonight, instead of opening presents, I'm gonna be Zoom calling for the first time on this laptop. What's up guys? Those like champagne. When it's like before a long weekend. <laughs> I'm cooking taco. Oh, mm. nice. And then... Oh, okay. Let me check it out. So last night was the first time I was able to check out Zoom on my MacBook. It's actually pretty cool. I've always seen it being used on Facebook, but never used it personally in my life. You're able to communicate with people and see people in their different screens, uh, different people's reactions to what's going on. I know it's not new for you guys, but for me, I was like, this is crazy. So I could see why schools are doing this in real time. You're able to social distance, you're able to teach classes in a safe social setting. I don't know, for me it just blows my mind that we do have the technology to do online classes like that. I remember before in university, the online classes would be more of like discussion boards, writing up responses. Nowadays you can just do it live. When the teachers are teaching, you can see the students interacting, and it's really cool that you can do this at this time. So December 28 has a couple birthdays. Just want to do a quick shout out to a couple of birthday twins. Ariel and Anna, what's up? Happy birthday, guys! Man, V Supper Club, do you guys remember that? Yeah, anyways, happy birthday, Din Din, happy birthday, Don. Hope you guys are doing well. So it's pretty windy outside and a little bit chilly. Up to 42 kilometers an hour winds right now. Feels like negative three outside, but after four nights of just doing night shifts, my fridge is empty, so I gotta go grocery shopping the only way I know how.
finally put aside some time to try this lentil soup and I will let you know if this soup is worth the half an hour waiting time and the 13 bucks it cost. Let's see how this tastes. Is it worth 13 bucks a container? Let's see. It's bomb. It's bomb. I definitely recommend this soup. I just got a call saying that I have a package to pick up in my lobby and I didn't order anything. Ooh, I wonder what it is. The DHL. Let's see what we got. Ooh, Boxing Day gift. Boxing Day gift. So evidently that package was a secret Santa gift for one of our friends, Paul. So can't open it up because it's not ours. But maybe, I think it's time. Time to open presents. Alas, we've come to the end of the first episode of Live From Last Week. I want to thank you guys for watching. Please like, share, and subscribe to the channel, and comment below on what you think. Also want to tell you guys to stay safe, stay healthy, and I'll see you next time on Live From Last Week.